has completed its Beidou Navigation Satellite System, or BDS, becoming the fourth country in the world with a global navigation network. The other three are GPS of the US, GLONASS of Russia, and Galileo of Europe. So what makes China's BDS stand out from its competitors? As the name suggests, the Global Navigation Satellite System provides navigation and location services on a 24-hour basis. From what we know so far, building a sound satellite system costs a bundle. Besides, the other systems are already well established. Now you may ask, why China bothers to have a new one if there's nothing special? Firstly, the plan of all other systems is to have 24 satellites in medium Earth orbit. In addition to the 24 satellites, the BDS constellation also has three satellites in geostationary Earth orbit and three in inclined geosynchronous orbit. What's special about the extra six satellites is that they have a relatively fixed range of activity. This layout can enhance BDS accuracy in China and the Asian Pacific region to 5 meters in comparison with the 10 meter accuracy in other areas. Secondly, BDS has a trump card, the short message service. It is a function that allows users to have a two-way communication. In areas not covered by cellular or communication signals, BDS can make the short message service available in uninhabited areas, such as deserts, forests, and mountainous or polar regions. With this service, users in distress can inform the rescue team about their location and condition. As the most populated country in the world, it is important for China to have its own global navigation satellite system to meet the needs of the country's socio-economic development. In fact, the BDS is also good business. Official data shows that China's satellite industry has maintained a 20% annual growth since 2012. BDS itself contributes about 80% of it. The system has also generated tens of billions of dollars and countless high-paying jobs. Yes, Beidou is awesome, but with improvements in functions, it will have much more to offer in the future.